Greetings, YouTube. I'm getting older. I started my YouTube channel in my late 20s, and I am now almost in my mid-30s. Which, you know, growing up, it's a random tangent, but like when I was 6 or 7, I think, I found out that Jesus died at 33. And when you're 6 or 7, at that point, you don't think like, wow, that's not that old. You think, I guess that's old. So now that I'm past the uh, Jesus R.I.P. age, I'm like, Man, this may not be old to a lot of people, but I'm starting to have senior moments like every day. And so when it comes to this side quest, which I think has been really solid. I mean, I, I would put this better than last month. And in terms of um, future side quests, I'd be excited to see a, a version of this again. Because even though some of the nodes are annoying and you need certain counters like this week, Mole God and Falcon especially help with the auto block, you can jump into it as many times as you want and most importantly there's zero energy cost so for hero use you can see that i uh put up 2.8 million points 90 percent of that yesterday was just me watching tv and looking down after a auto fight path had been completed for the best one to auto fight, which I think is week two of the heroic difficulty. I would just set my six stars up and the best is when like say cosmic uh, attack is going on because then you get your full six star cosmic team and it could be if you know, rank ones, it wouldn't matter. And then you just auto fight the path and then when it's done, you just refresh and you get all the points and then some for hero use and you're actually getting Bonus points for two different events, a 7-hour event and a 22-hour event, at once. It's genius. I love when stuff like this happens. But because I had a senior moment back to the beginning of this video, I forgot or didn't realize that we were going to get this class and talent event, which, as you can see, I've maxed out the points for, and it says, win fights using Cosmic, Mutant, or Science Champions. So... I put all my team last night with Cosmic because I think it was like Arena Points were the event. I think it was Tech Arena. So all Cosmic did auto fight. So I was able to double up and I was able to get a ton of hero use points to guarantee myself the free tier four class catalyst, which really comes in handy, especially because the RNG is going to screw you so often when you need to land on a specific class that you're trying to rank up. But two... Speed of Tier 4 Class Catalyst. This event's been awesome. So, not only do they give you that side quest calves, but they also give you one of each Tier 4 Class Catalyst. Now, if I could have tweaked this, and I get the perspective, this kind of reminds me of like a Power Rangers meets Tier 4 Class Catalyst, where you're getting one of each color. But I think if Kabam really wanted to make this all time historic, Every time you claimed one of these, and this does give you eventually another chance to get a three-star, most likely. But who knows? Maybe a six-star Hercules. What if every time you claimed one of these milestones, instead of it being a different class, it was a Tier 4 Class Catalyst Selector? So then, you had a chance, because it starts out as, as a Tier 4 Basic, to get one, two, three, four, five, six to get six tier four class catalyst selectors of the same class. Because I don't know about you, but when I go to my tier four class catalyst, it's pretty obvious that there is one class, thanks to recent rank ups, that needs help a lot more than others. Yeah, 13 cosmic, four mutant, 14 science, uh, nine mystic, 16 skill, and 20 tech. So, I would have chosen most likely all mutant for that rank up. But, you know, didn't happen. Uh, it is also worth noting that it is a smart thing to continue to open tier 3 class catalyst if you have the black ice of store and you are maybe at least throne breaker. Maybe they do this for calves too. But remember, once a month, speaking of tier 4 class catalyst strategy, you can trade in three of the tier three class catalyst specific class for one tier four basic. 
amazing value, especially if you're like me and you've got thousands of fragment crystals lying around, even hundreds of fully formed. I'm also apparently allergic to tier three basic because I'm about to uh, sneeze or tier, th tier three class catalyst, I should say. I also don't think, especially as you're ranking up six stars for July 4th week, you never have too many tier four basic. So uh, have a great rest of your day, YouTube. Thanks for watching. Uh, this was a really great um, bonus aspect of the side quest. I think Kabam deserves credit. Next time to make it better, just make it tier four class catalyst selector so we can get the specific class we're needing six different times.